Hello everybody, I'm Richard, Richard Wilson from Church of Digital. These are my five top digital marketing success factors. I've been helping businesses with digital marketing for 20 years now, so these are based on my experience of watching, observing and taking part in digital marketing activities over many years. So number one, taking time to plan. So planning is a good thing uh, in our personal lives, in our business lives. So obviously in digital marketing, it's a good thing to plan. So have a good sit down, a good think about how many customers you're looking to gain from digital marketing. What sort of things do you think you're going to do to get those customers? Uh, what your targets are, etc. cetera. Um, have a good think about the activities you're going to actually carry out as well. So a good think and a good plan is the foundation for digital marketing success. Number two, knowing your target audience. Well, obviously knowing your audience is really important. Um, and it's absolutely essential in the way you know, for example, that whether they're business to consumer or business to business, what are the key characteristics, who do you want to target your online content at? That's really vital. Um, you might want to do an exercise called customer personas, where you write down all the key characteristics of a typical customer, a typical profitable customer, I should say, and that might help guide you. Once you feel you know your audience, that can help you in terms of your strategy as to, for example, which online marketing channel you're going to use, which social media platforms, some are more business to consumer, some of more business to business. Might help you in terms of how you target your website content, for example. Number three, great content. Well, you'll hear me say a lot, content is king, and you know, other people say that, and probably content is the most important um, of the key marketing success factors for, for your digital marketing. It's also the most challenging, I think, Clients find it the hardest to create and curate good content. And that's partly down to a lack of confidence, a perceived lack of skill, perhaps a, a sense that people might not be interested in what they have to say. Um, but really, um, it, it's a question of practice makes perfect. So my advice is just do some content. Don't wait for you perceive they got it perfect. Get out and do it. Learn from what, what works and what doesn't work. And if it goes wrong, it doesn't matter. Um, and just get in the habit of doing it. Get in the habit of perhaps doing video, perhaps doing audio, perhaps writing blog posts, perhaps doing uh, regular posting on social media, regular updates of your website. Get in the habit of doing it. Number four, sustainability. I think... Probably another big challenge that people have is keeping up a pace that they can stick to. And that leads us on to the subject of consistency as well. A consistency is absolutely key to your audience engaging with you. So there's nothing worse, in my view, than somebody who starts off with a commitment to doing 20 or 30 posts a month, um, does it, exhausts themselves, stops, and starts again and stops and starts again. Consistency is really important, so pick a sustainable pace. Pick something that you can stick to and you can keep to. So if you can realistically feel that in terms of your resources and your skills and your time, you can only do one great blog post a month, do one great blog post a month. And obviously get some help on creating content if you need to, but stay in control of it, but make it sustainable. Number five. Measurement. So measurement is really key in all things. The good thing about digital marketing is more than most things, it's very measurable. There are a lot of analytics and data that you're given all the time on your website, say Google Analytics, all the social media platforms give you analytics about how well your posts are doing. Use that information to guide what works and what doesn't work. Um, what works, do more of, and what doesn't work, do less of it. Perhaps pick two or three key metrics that you look at every month, 
So, for example, the overall audience that you've reached on Facebook or the overall number of visits to your website. Pick something really simple that you, it's not a big deal to look at, it's not hard to find. You're going to look at every month and you're going to measure against previous months and see how you're doing. So there you are, really simple. My five top tips for digital marketing success. Get in touch if you want a great digital marketing strategy or you just want to chat about getting good at digital. Find me on the usual places, LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, and by searching Richard Dawson Cheshire Digital. Um, please go to my website. And on my website at cheshiredigitalmarketing.co.uk, you can find links to my YouTube channel where you can see all my updates there. You can find the link to my email, mar to my email marketing list. You can keep up to date with all the latest free hint hints and tips. Um, and indeed, you can book an appointment with me for a free digital marketing strategy session. So go there, uh, have a look, get in touch if you need me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.